are here in the Bushwick neighborhood of Brooklyn at the garage of Fly Cleaners, an on-demand laundry service. We're going to be talking to David Salama and Max Adler about why they're built in Brooklyn. What is Fly Cleaners? Fly Cleaners is the most convenient way to do your dry cleaning and laundry. An on-demand answer to the inconvenience that's often laundry and dry cleaning. What we've done is that we basically have put the entire control of the operation into people's hands via their smartphone. You're able to open up the app, you can track us as we come to you, you get notified of when your clothing's ready. We come directly to your door seven days a week, 6 a.m. to midnight. Fly Cleaners was conceived by our co-founder Seth Berkowitz and myself. He founded and runs a company called Insomnia Cookies. He was able to take a very simple concept by giving it to people the way they want it, how they want it, when they want it. He was able to build a national empire out of it. Seth came to me with the idea of doing something similar within dry cleaning and laundry because to him it was another industry where the focus wasn't necessarily on what the customer wanted. Laundry and dry cleaning has always been a problem for me. Personally living in the city, a way to make it more convenient is a no-brainer. Do you guys do the cleaning yourself? We partner with local facilities that we establish a strong relationship with. Um, we seek out facilities or partners that really mirror what we're about, the responsiveness, the level of customer service that we intend to deliver. We are probably a technology company first, but we're this sort of hybrid between the physical and technological world. We price our services to be comparable or cheaper than the neighborhood services. We think that it's just laundry and dry cleaning for all. It's anybody who values their time, anybody who's looking for something that's a little bit more convenient. And so we have parents that use us, we have people who work long hours, our own employees use us as well. How did you choose Williamsburg to start with? I've been a lifelong resident of Brooklyn. I've lived here for over 30 years. There were a lot of parallels between what I've seen happen in Williamsburg over the last few years and what we were trying to do here with laundry and dry cleaning. We looked at a bunch of different uh, markets and sort of the demographics surrounding those areas and picked uh, Brooklyn, specifically Williamsburg, Bushwick and Greenpoint as a great place for us to beta test our concept. And we thought that it would be a natural fit for us to bring a new concept to an area that was so open to change and to new ideas. Basically the life of a fly guy, which is what we're about to experience, pickups and deliveries based on you know, our proprietary algorithm that routes the trucks to the nearest location to give the customers the lowest wait time. And so we're gonna be picking up uh, bags of dirty laundry and basically introducing them into our system by scanning them. And I'll be showing you all the sort of equipment that we use throughout the day. And once they're in the system, you know, they get routed to the laundromats that we've partnered with and ultimately clean laundry will get delivered back to its rightful owner. And so we're gonna do the rounds. We'll probably meet a bunch of people out here in Brooklyn and see the sites. It's a, actually a really fun job. I mean, you're cruising around. Everybody's happy to see the laundry guy, right? You know, they're just blown away by the fact that they open the app, they hit a button, and we're there in the number of minutes that we tell them we're gonna be there. We're so hands-on with what we do that it's all of our people, our trucks, we're on the ground. It doesn't really matter if you're a startup restaurant or food truck or technology company or nonprofit. Brooklyn is really home to a whole slew of people that are just really taking new ideas across the spectrum. The startup scene is awesome in Brooklyn. I mean, there's a ton of young companies coming here to either sort of incubate their ideas or to just cohabitate with other companies and sort of share the creativity. One of our biggest focuses has been on making it a scalable business. And now as we're moving into Manhattan, we're sort of testing that theory. And so far it's, you know, scaled fairly well into our new markets. And so we don't see any reason why it couldn't work in a bunch of different cities down the line. What's your favorite spot in Brooklyn? So right now my favorite spot in Brooklyn is right around the corner over here, Roberta's Pizza, which is just off the charts, good pizza. A great story. They found like a, a place in Italy that would send them a brick oven and they were like, okay, fine. They didn't even know how to get it into the building. My favorite spot in Brooklyn right now is uh, this barbecue joint called Delaney's Barbecue. It's over in uh, Williamsburg and they call it Brisket Town. 
brisket's outstanding there. It's great that we have great technology and our app looks cool and we have an, an awesome algorithm that drives all of our trucks. But at the end of the day, we also are really, really proud of the end product that we, that we give to people, which is high quality dry cleaning and laundry.